Hello. Uh, okay, now we are at, oops. Fix this, sorry. <laughs> the pressure cooker has finished. So I'm gonna put in the multi-cooker, which I'll say again is carrots, cabbage, and potatoes. Okay, I'm going to put this in here for about 12 minutes. Okay, and the pressure cooker will take um, maybe about 10 minutes for this little tab to go down. And when the tab goes down, we know that it's safe to open. Uh, you don't never want to open your pressure cooker prior to the tab going down. So, you know, by making this in the microwave, I save time, I save energy because the microwave uses less um, electricity and energy than does our stove top or oven. But this week is World Water Week, and I wanted to share some of the statistics. <laughs> but um, when you buy a bottle of water from a store, well, in Hawaii, and I know California is like that, but you pay a deposit also for the bottle. I think it's um, something like five cents a bottle here. In addition, to find the water, you pay for a deposit on the bottle. We do have a redemption program, but anyway, uh, because I live on the island, uh, recycling is huge for us because we don't want our island to be just a landfill in so many years from now. And um, these are our Echo water bottles. This is just one of them that I have, but I wanted to show you, and this is great for all the moms too. When you're going out for the day, grocery shopping or whatever, put the water in here for those that are uh, on formula and they have to mix the formula. Or just if you want your child, your toddler uh, to have a drink of water while you're out. But uh, I wanted to just show you that if this is an airtight liquid tight container so you don't have to worry about the spilling. You can put the milk in there, um, their juice or whatever, and don't have to worry about that. As long as you have it closed, no leaks. So uh, everywhere I go, I have a water. <laughs> so these are just some of the ones that I have. You know, I don't buy bottled water hardly ever. And I use my Muta mug for my hot coffee when I go out and I'm having a cup of coffee because I'm not one to buy coffee at the coffee shop. And then I have this large one here. So if I need to take something liquid, I can do so. But I wanted to just say a little bit more about our hostess, Anna. Thank you, Anna, for uh, allowing us to share Tupperware with you and your friends. And this is a dating gift that you'll be receiving, which is a mini salt and pepper shaker. But also, oh, let's see, what you Let me grab my book here. I wanted to share again the catalog for some of those that may not have been on earlier. But this is our catalog. If you wanted a copy mail to you, you can. Uh, comment or you can let Anna know and I'll mail one to you. Um, but also, you know, the shopping link will be here in the post. And then again, a reminder, if you would like to be a consultant, you can get a kit for 109, which is over 300 in products. Join the business and this is what the kit looks like. You get a lot of products. Wow. Nice products, and that's also online in this link. If you want to be just a virtual shopper, that would be $15. So this is my Tupperware menu. It's a big. So 
that's $15, okay? If you want to spend $15, or if you want the virtual kit, I mean, I'm sorry, the virtual kit is 15. If you want the other kit, it's 109. That's 140, 16, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 105. I have 108. I think I lost one of my dollars, but $109. And you can get the kit and start your business. So you can do the business. Um, depending on where you live, you can do live parties which were still basically virtual here in Hawaii, virtual parties. You can do Zoom, Facebook party, um, even a tech party, you can do that. So anyway, uh, I wanna check the chat and see if anyone has any questions or comments. Nope, no one chatted, but if you have a, a question, you may, um, Oops, I think I'm lost. I think I lost myself there a minute. <laughs> I'm learning technology. You know, technology is my, not my generation of expertise by no means, by no means. <laughs> I work in a pharmacy for out of my 42 years at long, 30 years in the pharmacy, but uh, we had typewriters when I started and we got computers, but it's a program. But learning all these things, you know, and I'm glad to still be able to learn things at my age. It's might be more challenging for some of the younger ones who are more technology savvy, but um, I appreciate the opportunity of getting to learn and continue learning in my life. <laughs> so anyway, if you want to jump on for the kit or the virtual kit, $15, and consultants earn 25%, and they also buy samples, and we earn, we, we get those at a 35% discount. So again, um, I have my canister set here, the window. I think, um, I'm not sure, Anna, if you have this set or not. Maybe it's a different set. But I have all my, um, some of my dry goods in here. I actually have two sets. So, I can keep everything. Flour, sugar, brown sugar, my rice. Uh, I have white rice and I have brown rice. Hawaii eats a lot of rice. I'm trying to not eat a lot of rice, <laughs> but anyway, sometimes we do that. So uh, view the catalog and the shopping link to see all of our products. You know, for those that like to bake, we have our silicone baking mat, which is, wow. Um, see how they make these um, cinnamon rolls. They look so delicious. And that is available to use in the microwave or bake in the oven up to 425 degrees. So again, our towels. And this one I've had, like I said, over 10 years in my kitchen. And I wanted to just do a little demo with that. This is our Tupper Mini, which is two ounces. And I have about one and three quarter ounce in here, but I wanted to show you um, how this towel is absorbing. And I have bought, um, prior to Tupperware having the microfiber towel, I have bought from the grocery store, Walmart or wherever. And there is no comparison. <laughs> the ones that I bought from school were really uh, after you washed them and I didn't dry it. Uh, it was very like scratchy, the material. But I just wanted to show you how fast this absorbed this water. 
So this was about one and three quarters ounces. This little container holds two ounces. So you have spills and it has little ones. There always will be spills. In fact, I spill <laughs> a lot. So it's wet. I would bring it out and just hang it on my oven uh, rack, my oven handle, and it'll dry in no time. And uh, actually, I had a few friends over the other night, and as soon as she sat down, my friend <laughs> spilled her glass of water. So grab that towel. And so we grab this one, or one like this, and we soak that up in no time. And they were amazed too, like, wow, how fast did that soak up? And it was like a tall glass of water. Mom. So this is how I love um, my microfiber towels. And this will be dry in no time. Mom. There, you wouldn't want to chat. Yeah, can you, can you share some of the things that you make in the pressure cooker? Oh, yes. Uh, my, my diet, I don't want to say diet, but my food intake right now is I'm really cut down on any kind of meat as much as possible. But things that I have made in the pressure cooker is um, a roast, a full roast with potatoes, carrots, all of that, onion. I've made a, a whole chicken. Now that, because chicken is okay, doctors say chicken and fish. I made a whole chicken in 25 minutes, uh, just uh, covering it with chipotle seasoning. And I used that, I had that for three, three meals. The night that I made it, I had it with, I believe a baked potato and a salad. The next night I made, um, in my micro per grill, I made, um, I added a little taco sauce and I had a, I made a, a taco salad with it. And then on the third night, and it was, you know, fairly good sized chicken. Third night, I made it into just a regular chicken salad with tossed greens. Um, besides this, um, I've made chicken stew. I've made curry stew. I mean, just any kind of soup or stew. Um, pork, pork chops is really good in there with mushroom soup and potatoes on the top. I've made that many times. I'm not eating that right now, but um, pretty much anything um, you would make on the stove, you can make in the pressure cooker and it's 30 minutes or less. Pretty much the max of the pressure cooker is a 30 minute process. So um, it's very fast. You can put it on, go and do something else, take a shower, watch the news, read the newspaper or whatever you want to do and you don't have to worry about it. With the stove, of course, um, you have to watch the stove. You have to be in the stove. And because I live in a warm climate, it's very windy today. But in the summer, I don't want the stove on for any reason. So this is finished. And in this uh, multi-cooker, you can also make your boiled eggs in here. A dozen is, uh, depending on the size, 10 to 12 minutes. So of course I want to open this away from me. Let's see if I can get a better view of this. Okay, you see how the steam is coming out? Can you see that? So here's my carrots. I'll just take a fork and test it. I might need to leave a little bit longer, but my cabbage is crispy and maybe just a little bit more on that. And my potatoes. I think um, might be, yeah, just a few more minutes. So I had it for, what did I put it for 12? So I might put it for five more, but I'll be making two batches today because we are going to get together <clears throat> our family for Jared's birthday, which was on Wednesday, St. Patrick's Day, but we couldn't get together again, but, um, fast meals um, this is the way to go to keep your things fresh in the uh, modular mates and organize your cabinet I'm gonna 
Let's stick this back in. Okay, I think this has gone down too. So I can open this. And you can tell it's gone down because there was no hissing sound when I pulled up this tab, this little handle. If there was a sound, then I would close it. That meant it's too soon. So this is our corned beef. I'm just going to pour this juice on here. And this is our corned beef. It's ready. And mm. as soon as the vegetables are done, I'm going to shred this and uh, put it in one of my Tupperware and take it to my daughter Marla's house. I'm going to keep the vegetables separate until we're ready to eat. But if I were doing it at home, I would go ahead and shred this, add my cabbage, my potatoes, and my carrots, and then I would be good to go. But because I'm going to transport it there, I think I'm going to leave it separate until we're ready to serve. But I'm going to go ahead and shred the corned beef. So again, I want to thank Anna for being a host. Um, and she's a special person to me because she's my sister above me, granddaughter. And I really appreciate her being a hostess and also helping me in learning how to do a Tupperware party through the social media world we're in. <laughs> so again, go ahead and talk to Anna about hosting your party or becoming a consultant. You get a thank you gift and you get uh, to choose other gifts. Thank you. Um, that, I'm sorry, that's a dating gift. And then the thank you gift. There's four to choose from. Uh, Crystal Wave, which is for the microwave. A uh, bowl, mixing bowl. I know Anna's a a baker of beautiful cakes, uh, a French Mart mini to keep your vegetables fresh, or just a little two-piece serving cup. So there's so many advantages of being in Tupperware. You know, there's awards, there's even trips, there's a car. Tracy drives a Tupperware car and has for 20 years. I think she's on like number eight or nine car right now. And every two years she gets a new car. So anyway, there's many advancements in the Tupperware business. And um, if you ever see a Tupperware car driving around your area, then you know that that person is a director in Tupperware. And that's a really good uh, level to be and a good income earning level to be. So I hope to make a trip to Texas this year, but we will see how things are. Um, maybe for the end of the year, we'll see October. Or so we'll see how things are going. So you guys can keep me updated on what Texas is doing besides not wearing a mask <laughs> anymore. It's still required here, but anyway. And I have a Tupperware mask, but I think it's in my car right now. So I don't forget to have it when I leave the house. Okay, so this is our corned beef. I have my vegetables going. And uh, be sure to take advantage of our water bottles because um, we don't need to be buying 24 bottles of water. Yeah. On a daily basis, I have a water filter pitcher. It's actually made by Tupperware that we had so many years ago, but I keep that in my refrigerator. And of course, my refrigerator has a filtered water on the outside, but I use the one in my refrigerator for my coffee, or if I make tea, or if I make my cold brew, I use the filtered water. But Hawaii has a pretty great water. I must admit, I can drink the water with no problem, right from the faucet. But I do filter. But again, close the cover and you have no no dripping, no leaks. So these are, are waterproof uh, liquid 
liquid type, I think is the right term to use. Airtight liquid type. So you can use them for your sauces too. You have to transport a sauce when you go somewhere, potluck, and you want to add that sauce or dressing when you get there. Put it in one of these and you don't have to worry about it leaking. Okay, so I guess that covers um, what we were going to cover today, but I will keep in touch with Anna. And uh, please check out the website, the link there to do your shopping and uh, take advantage of the specials. Like we have a whole set of special and our microfiber is a special and our servant center. And I know that's on Anna's wish list. And so is uh, the cereal store. She needs those for her children's cereal. Okay, so I want to thank you. And my number is 808-561-2577. If you need to contact me, or you can text me, call me, or uh, make comments here on the party, and we will respond. Okay, so you guys have a blessed day. The rest of the day is Sunday. And I'm going to be joining my family for for beef and cabbage. Okay, so thank you, thank Anna, you, and thank you everybody else who's been on. And this is Aloha from Hawaii. This is the Shaka. This is the Aloha side. <laughs> okay, so I'll see you soon, and I'll be in touch with the comments and so forth. Okay, so have a beautiful day. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. -bye. Thank you. Okay. I'll see you guys Bye. hopefully in 2021. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye, Tracy. Bye-bye. <laughs>